there everybody, it's me, Hology, and today I'm going to be showing you the latest update to the Microsoft Photos app, version 16.1017.10000.0, which can be downloaded onto devices running the latest Redstone 2 builds. Starting up the app for the first time, you'll see a new update message with some nice animations that let you know what's new in the Photos app, which I find quite nice. This update brings focus on making the Photos app more PC-friendly, as we've seen in continuous updates in the last few months, with different mouse settings and a more desktop-friendly placement of buttons, which to me highly resembles the UI sketch and layout that we saw back in the Windows Live Photo Gallery. Getting into the changes, we of course now have some new controls at the bottom and at the top, including a new Draw option, which allows you to draw using Windows Ink tools onto your photos or even videos. Next to that, we have the Edit button, upon which opening brings you to an updated photo editing UI, which again resembles that that we saw in the old Windows Live Photo Gallery, only this time with much more immersive previews of the edits in the UI. The tools are divided into two sections, Enhance and Adjust. The Enhance page has a magic wand photo enhancement tool that we're used to, only now the strength can be adjusted to your liking. Below that, we have Filters, again which the strength can be adjusted. In the Adjust page, we have sliders for Light, Color, Warmth, Clarity, and Vignette, as well as a Spot Fix and Red Eye tool. Interestingly, we seem to have lost the options for Highlights and Shadows. Once you're done making your edits, the Save, Share, and Undo buttons are all at the bottom. If you're on Redstone Builds, I highly encourage that you take a look at the new Editor and Draw options, and I'll leave you to explore how drawing on your videos work. If you'd like to keep up to date about future Windows 10 and Windows 10 mobile features, make sure to like this video and subscribe for more. Thank you, goodbye.